Now, your local weather with the KX Storm Team. And welcome back, everybody. Wednesday evening means it's time for Cash Rise Backyard Barbecue. Today's winner, Elaine Tazarek. I said it right. Been practicing did. this name. Uh, congratulations. You won the uh, Cash Rise set, including the gift card, the uh, barbecue food, and everything. And uh, you have a bunch of family and friends here with you. Mm -hmm. So, again, congratulations. Uh, couple questions for you. I've been doing a little bit of an experiment here, a culinary and meteorological experiment. So you're going to be part of this now. So i got a couple questions. One, hot dogs or steaks? How what? Hot dogs or steaks? Steaks. steaks. Okay. I was <laughs> raised on a farm. Okay. Meat, potatoes, yeah, and a vegetable. Yeah, the pretty uh, big consensus here in North Dakota. And the second question, if you were to have a perfect outdoor temperature for a backyard barbecue, what would that temperature be? It's got to be today. You can't ask for a nicer day. Oh, it is just, just beautiful. Whatever the temperature is right now. You ordered it? Got to figure out what the Thank temperature you. is. Thank <laughs> you. I guess we'll figure that out in a second here. So it's about 80 degrees outside. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, congratulations again, Elaine Tazarek. Tazarek. Thank okay, you. Okay, you're very welcome. We'll go ahead and uh, pass it on to uh, Jim here, the uh, manager <laughs> of the North Store. And... Uh, what we got going on? Oh, we got a lot going on. First of all, Elaine is a great host. And uh, second, uh, the cash-wise, we have uh, 5.98 T-bone steaks this week, so great for the grill. Uh, we also have red and sea uh, red and green seedless grapes uh, for $1.48 a pound, Dorito party size chips for $3.33 a bag, and Pepsi cubes for $6.98. So it's just a great week to come on down and awesome. get ready for the weekend. Sounds like a good uh, could be a good weekend for another backyard barbecue. Awesome, that's great uh, to hear. All right, let's talk about that weather, shall we? Uh, let's take a look. Actually, first we're going to start with some of the rain reports that we got last night. And uh, in fact, look at that. Uh, just a little bit north of the Butte area, there got over three. Three inches of rain, number of spots uh, near uh, two inches, including Mohaw, Mercer, and Velva. So a good drink of water uh, for many of us uh, last night. All right, let's go ahead now and uh, we'll take a look at uh, some current conditions out there. We're looking at uh, Bismarck and uh, downtown. Uh, you can see, hopefully here, that uh, we will see that uh, we're looking at a pretty nice day out there. We can officially get the actual temperature here. We can, uh, there it is, 83 degrees right now with uh, calm winds at the moment. Dew point 57 degrees, so a little humidity in the air. Uh, temperatures and winds are in the 70s and 80s. So right now in Bismarck, it's 83. So Elaine, looking at you, your perfect temperature would be 83 degrees. Dew points, it's uh, some drier air back to the west right now. Dew points in the 40s. Dew points in the 50s and 60s to the east, so a little more humidity to the east. We got to 83 degrees today in Bismarck, so officially uh, right about where the uh, high temperature is right now. Uh, clear skies out there, really nice. A little rain in eastern North Dakota, but we have high pressure building on in from the west. That will keep our skies clear overnight tonight, and we'll be looking at high pressure still in control tomorrow. So sunshine tomorrow, but notice we start to get a southeasterly wind out there by tomorrow afternoon. That will increase temperatures and humidity levels by Friday, and we're going to have a cold front moving in on Friday, and that will set the stage for possible thunderstorm development across central North Dakota primarily by Friday late afternoon into the evening. Some of that could be severe. Storm Prediction Center does have a severe risk, a marginal risk, for Friday. Lows tonight could be a little cool out there, especially across western North Dakota with that drier air down in the low 50s, but we'll warm up into the upper 80s and low 90s tomorrow. Temperatures into the 80s back towards the east. Dickinson three-day forecast, we're warming up to about 90 degrees on Friday, upper 80s for Williston uh, through uh, the rest of the weekend into the early part of the weekend with slight chances for rain. And Minot, we'll see those chances for rain increase by Friday, late Friday afternoon and evening with slight chances this weekend. Bismarck, you're looking at a nice but warm day tomorrow. It'll be pretty hot and humid on Friday, and then we'll see some chances for thunderstorms coming into the forecast Friday evening, and then again possibly by Saturday afternoon. Could get interesting, and it looks like a lot of fun out there. When we come back, can the vistas that come back?